Thank you, Greta. Turning now to the South Range community. They came together this morning to show love and support for each other and Corinne Gump's family. Corinne and her grandparents, Bill and Judy Schmidt, were all killed in the house fire on Powers Way in Youngstown Monday morning. Dozens of people attended a memorial service at the school's auditorium today. Most were wearing teal, which was Corinne's favorite color. Organized by South Range's Fellowship of Christian Athletes team, the service aimed at providing some comfort during what's been a very difficult time. We are here to, uh, as a community, support this family and support the school and the students and classmates who knew her and just um, build people up and show them that God is there in the midst of the awful situation that's happened. Many people brought in stuffed animals to form a memorial for Corinne. We're told all of those items will be donated to a local shelter. And funeral arrangements have been set for all three victims of Monday's fatal fire. A service for Judy Schmidt will be held on Saturday afternoon at 2, while a separate ceremony for Corinne Gump is scheduled for Monday morning at 11. Calling hours for all three of the victims are set for Saturday from 3 to 6 p.m. They'll all be held at the Davis Becker Funeral Home, which is on Market Street in Boardman.